What's up YouTube? Welcome to the video today. We are going to be playing the private beta for Call of Duty World War 2. When I was downloading the game, I happened to be recording and I caught myself getting a little excited for the game. I'm going to let you guys hear it right now. This was my reaction once the game was downloaded. We're playing the World War 2 private beta today. Let's go. Yeah, I finally downloaded this game, and I'm ready to shoot some noobs. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. You can roast me down in the comments if you'd like. Now we're going to get into my first gameplay on the Call of Duty World War II beta. See if I can drop the nuclear. I think it's a vicious metal is what it is, 30 plus. We're going to go ahead and get into it right now. Cross your fingers. Wish me luck. I'm probably going to be terrible. Who knows? So we're using the airborne division and we have the grease gun as the only smg unlocked right now i'm changing my settings got the vibration off we don't want nothing to do with that and i put my sensitivity on 4-4 making sure there's nothing else i need to change before we get into this gameplay i want to set myself up for success let's see how we did here let's get into it now remember this is my first game so I'm just feeling it out right now. I have no idea where the spawns are in this map or anything about this map because it just released, I believe, today for the Xbox One beta or week two for the private beta for Call of Duty World War II. I have not seen gameplay on this map, so I am completely confused. But well, we're looking for people trying to find that first kill. Hopefully, we can start off not with a death. I'm trying to get a kill for my first one. Where they at? Where they at? Where they at? Oh, can't go up that way. Oh, we can jump down that way. Here we go. There it is. Boots on the ground, Call of Duty. How do you guys feel? Let me know in the comments down below. Have you played this beta yet? And if you have, do you like it? When I first started playing Call of Duty, it was all boots on the ground. I think I started, actually World War 2, I played a lot, or not World War 2, World at War, my fault, World at War, I played that game a lot, I loved how it felt, I had a lot of friends that played it, a lot of memories with that game, Black Ops 2, Modern Warfare 3, those were probably my top 3 Call of Duties, boots on the ground that I played, and then we had Advanced Warfare, Black Ops 3, and of course, everyone's favorite, Infinite Warfare, which we're going to have to go back to after this weekend we're gonna go back to that game start jetpacking again for a couple months then we'll be back on the ground I like how this feels for sure it's got a good feel to it I think this is a little too far for the grease gun what I've seen and heard the grease gun is absolutely terrible I don't really like the sight the iron sight that's with the weapon that's for sure I can't tell are those our is that our glide bomb I don't know I didn't die though, so that's good. Here we go. We got a kill. Let's go. We're going to move in here. Here we go. We got another kill. I like how it feels. I think the time to time to kill is okay. I think it's definitely okay. It's not too fast. It's not too slow. I have no idea where I'm aiming or where people are going to be. There's another kill right there. Almost to our street. See if we can get that. Give me a kill. We got our aircraft. There we go. We died though, so I'm trying to get to the glide bomb. That looks sick. The glide bomb coming out of the helicopter or airplane. Alright, where are they at? Come on now. Give me some easy kills. There we go. I like that. There's another one. I like that. Maybe I should sign up for a professional Call of Duty league. Look at these. Look at these skills right now. Oh, just kidding. Take me off the roster. It's been so long since we've had a Call of Duty boots on ground game. We'll see if they did a good job with this one. They really had no choice, you know. I hope they're not going to show us everything in this beta. 
Maybe they'll release an atomic bomb for a 25 kill streak. That would be awesome. Infinite Warfare right now, you can go for Diaz all day. Add some excitement to the game. Go back to Black Ops 3. If you drop a 25, 30 kill streak, you're getting the nuclear medal. Nothing too exciting. They just give you a medal. That's it. Infinite Warfare, you get to drop that D at. Previous Call of Duties, you have Moabs. Tactical nukes. I never really dropped a whole lot of nukes back in the day, but I've been dropping them recently. Well, recently, I can't get a deatomizer strike to save my life. But we're not worried about Infinite Warfare. We're worried about this World War II beta getting these kills with this grease gun right now. There he is. Uh-oh. We're going to get melted. Nope. Not today. Sit down. We got a buzz kill. All right. Let's keep moving. It's crazy how much smaller the maps are when it's boots on the ground. But it, obviously, it's going to take a little bit longer to get around the map. But it's pretty crazy. The speed of the game is good, too. I like that. Don't feel like I'm creeping around corners. Feel like I can still dodge a bullet if I need to. Probably not gonna happen. I'll get smacked if I try to dodge a bullet. Oh, he's up top. Uh oh. Look at that. Look at that movement. Get out of here. Where'd he go? You gonna run, son? Come back. I don't have time for you playing games. Give me a kill. I don't know where I'm going. There he is. Oh no way. That hip fire was nasty, wasn't it? Look at that hip fire. It was terrible. We're going to put on the suppressor with the airborne division. You get a couple different features with it. You get a speed up ability where you're going to move around the map a little bit quicker. You also can attach a suppressor. I think just to SMGs. I don't believe the suppressor will go on any weapon. I'm not exactly sure yet. We're going to pick up this PPSH. This gun melts from what I've seen. I didn't get to use it there though. Died after I picked it up. We're going to camp back here. There he is. It's funny to see now if I look back on this gameplay after we've been playing World War II for, you know, even three, four months. These maps are so foreign and new to us. But once we play them every day over and over, we get so good at the maps. We know them like the back of our hand. But right now, it's just so foreign. Like, I'm clueless when I'm playing this game. I mean, probably within the next few days, I'll get the maps down, but I think after you play a Call of Duty for so long, you can think of a map right now and say, yep, there, that thing's there. They spawn here. Right now, I have no idea. No idea. I don't even know if I should go left or right. The mini map on this game is kind of weird. It's a circle shape. I don't think we've had the circle in a Call of Duty before. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't believe we have. You can't see a whole lot unless they're right up next to you. Which, I don't know how I feel about that as we get melted in this room. I'll get used to it, though. That's for sure. I'm liking the game. It's something fresh, something new. I always like a new Call of Duty. I think this is my first beta I've ever played. I believe. I don't think I played Black Ops 3 beta. I might have. Not sure. I don't remember. I did not play Infinite Warfare's beta. I wasn't a fan of the way Infinite Warfare looked. Once it came out though, I hopped off that hate bandwagon. And I really started to enjoy the game. I, I think Infinite Warfare is great. Obviously it had a whole lot of problems in the beginning. We got him. Oh. They called me out. It said I was in the bookstore. They came rushing in and killed me. I keep going to this side. There's a guy sitting in the middle of the map that's been sniping. So I'm staying away from the middle like you always should. Unless you have a sniper. Middle of the map is dangerous. I'm trying to pick up that gun and we died there. And the score, the score does go up to 100. I thought I saw it going to 75. Maybe they raised the... Uh, score max there i'm not sure most boots on the ground call of duty are 75 i could be wrong on that too but i feel like they are it's long games you get a 10 minute limit and then the 100 score 
we'll see they're always gonna tweak stuff that's what the beta's for just to mess around see if there's anything that really needs to be changed first gameplay i'm gonna have no idea but i'm gonna make plenty of videos this of this this weekend it's gonna be out hopefully like middle day on monday hopefully they don't cut it off too soon we'll get plenty of gameplay hopefully we can drop a vicious metal we're gonna get this stg out use the ppsh if i see anything crazy i'll definitely make a video of it you guys will hear my thoughts and opinions along the way this gameplay is almost over here we got oh we got melted we are 20 and 19 20 and 19 guys we went positive for the first gameplay on the call of duty world war 2 beta i hope stats don't transfer over i'm trying to run like a four or five kd on this game we're starting off with a one that's fine though we didn't go negative we're gonna learn as much as possible and then we'll be ready when it releases in two months once again i hope you guys enjoyed this video drop a like if you did subscribe if you're brand new That's going to do it for today's video. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, and I'll talk to you guys later.